Uh, welcome back. I'm trying something new. Kitty Mates uh, recommended me doing this and now I'm going to try it. I'm going to play the worst games there is when it comes to horror. That is based on the reviews. And I'm starting with this one. The Tower. <laughs> This has bad reviews. Listen to this. The first comment. Do not buy this. Exclamation mark times three. <laughs> that's, that's a big red flag. <laughs> and the next one. This isn't a game. <laughs> Still, I bought it. So far, it looks kind of cool. It looks expensive. Please adjust. Oh, I couldn't do that. My eyes for the darkness takes may see no light but shadow. Is this my eye? That looks like a real eye, doesn't it? Someone is being tortured in the background. Has it begun? Right, get this bastard up. We're taking you somewhere lovely. Am I the bastard? Apparently, I think I was. Or is. <laughs> tower. I'm trapped in a tower. I'm going to find a way out. It's not that bad up to this point. Please. What? What is meant to have damned me so? In the king's name, what am I accused of? Please! Being what, a bastard? What of my wife? My little one? What fate has befallen them? Jailer! They'll be put upon a cross with the others at dawn. Pray for them. You bastards! You sons of whores! May God forsake you! May God forsake your souls! This game is based upon true events. During the 11th century, an Englishman was imprisoned for treason. He was held inside a fortified keep located in Surrey. For the purpose of our story, he has been named Elliot. The Englishman's eventual fate cannot be... Go so fast. Four months later, still in prison. I had remained in that godforsaken place for what felt like an eternity. Those men were not of holy stature. They wore the skins of men, but here existed hidden demons. Murderers, torturers, rapists. All these acts hidden from holy eyes in this place of damnation. Episode 1 It was either through too much need or a lack of attention that a small opportunity had presented itself to me. My arm had become free due to the jailer's desire to return quickly to his wench, and I was not about to let this newly found hope escape me. I pushed away from that damned stone, my restrained arm resisting their torturous shackle. Break free space. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm free! I'm free from the shackles! No, I take the shackles with me. <laughs> Listen. Why do I have this thing in front of me? Can't I take off this uh, mask? Or this robe thing? Uh, what the hell is this? Why isn't that mouse working? There! First bug. No! <laughs> so, uh, how do we proceed? I done it. Oh, yeah. Finally, my bounds had been shed. A nearby torch allowed me to witness my captor's work. My wrists were raw, as were my lips. I would need to seek water. I looked about my cell, a dark place of cruel stone and twisted roots. I gazed upon the faceless maw of that darkness then. Some would say that the devil fears nothing. Why are he talking like this? this? Shit! What is all this? Escape the tower. Yeah, stop talking poetry and try to escape. 
He's talking like a philosopher or something. All the time to himself, he must be crazy. Do I have a torch? No, here! The movement doesn't feel that bad. The controls. It's okay! My escape wasn't without incident. As I waded into that cold, stagnant water, its murky depths quenching the thirst of a few gnarled roots that had crept through the stonework, I began to wonder how the birds in such a state of neglect. Huh? He keeps talking in the background. <laughs> he continues to talk. Has suffered yet another cruel misfortune falling down through the prison ancient stonework and nearly drowning under untold years of rank soiled water. This dark forgotten case of the tower now forces him to seek both light and high ground. What does that mean? I fell down and was on crazy guy, old guy talking in the back. So it was like a monster that took me. The hollows. And now I can't see shit. No, <laughs> I can't see. Oh, up here. Yes, here I can go. I can recall stepping forth into that shadow as if it were only an hour ago. Yeah, yeah. The damn Crouch. Cold walls made from that demented stone. Can you please shut up? I'm trying to play. Way through that choking I'm trying dark. to save your ass and you continue talking. Ceaseless. Unnatural. Yes. Save that for a book. Now we're going to escape. No. No. <laughs> oh, I'm stuck. There. What is it? What is oh. That was kind of annoying. I was stuck there. Now I'm stuck again. Again, something. Something invisible. <laughs> that, that rope. I was stuck against the rope. During my trials within the tower, I encountered little places of respite. I used these to rest and collect my wits. Love a present. Blue light. Respite. Does that mean rest? No! I'm resting. I can save. Oh yeah, that's a saving spot. I can remember needing to rest at that point. Resting was my legs were burning. I didn't want to be idle for long. Ah uh, okay, I need to save in order to rest. I can do that. There! Now it's working. Is it saved? Oh man, started to lag. <laughs> Hello? You don't get out of my tower. No one does. Death claims you. Yeah, he shot me in the face. Over. Did I save? And there was not an auto save, not a checkpoint, and it restart this shit. I'm not going to do that. Definitely, I'm not going to do that. I got tired for playing it, if you know what I mean. I'm not sure what went wrong here. There's something wrong. It doesn't feel right when you play it. Okay, that was a bad, very bad horror game. Send me suggestions. I need some bad horror games if you want me to continue. Join my Discord server, follow the link in the description below and post them there okay catch you on the next video bye